Happy Wednesday, everybody. Dr. Dan here with Advanced Upper Cervical Chiropractic, and I'm happy to be joined by Jill West from Jill West Nutrition Consulting. For this week's episode, we're going to be focusing on a health theme this month, which is Heart Health Month, the month of February. So Jill will be sharing with us a little bit, uh, uh, three tips of how to increase our heart health this week and moving forward. But first, I just want Jill to introduce herself. Tell us where your practice is and uh, the kinds of people that you help. Okay, great. Uh, so thanks for having me. You're welcome. Um, I'm Jill West, and uh, my practice is in Lafayette, and I work with adults, teens, uh, kind of a wide range of people, helping them um, create personalized nutrition plans uh, based on their genetics, based on any health issues they have, uh, to help increase their wellness and longevity. Awesome. Well, Jill is an amazing uh, dietitian, nutritionist, and. Uh, She's someone who we trust to refer our patients to here in this office, so I'm excited to have her on today. And Jill, what are three tips that we can use to get healthier this week? Yeah, so Heart Health Month is really important. Um, it's the number one cause of death for both men and women. And so my three tips are prevention related. Um, one is uh, get your blood pressure and cholesterol checked if you haven't in the last couple of years. Really important to know what those numbers are. And then my food tip is to eat heart healthy foods mm -hmm. and three in particular that are really important for heart health are beans and lentils, mm -hmm. um, berries, and also um, oats. I'll give you one more, which is salmon. Any mm -hmm. of the fatty fish are really important for cholesterol. Um, and then my third tip is to be active. And oftentimes people um, uh, think, oh, I've got to go to the gym. But it can be smaller segments of time, bits and pieces fit in during the day, and adding up to a minimum of 30 minutes um, throughout the day most days. That's excellent. Thank you for sharing. I know uh, uh, nutrition and dietary advice can uh, uh, oftentimes lead to a lot of questions. So if you have any, please leave some in the comments. We'll be sure to get back to you. Mm -hmm. And thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next week. And don't forget, is your head on straight?